welcome back to my channel it's it's real here your pink headed girl rapid lucy um my life right now is pretty Guess what? <laughs> I'm a lucky bitch and I have two cancers at the same time. <laughs> As you know, I had thyroid cancer, so I had a big surgery and now I have results. I have Hodgkin lymphoma, so it's a cancer of uh, lymph system, <sighs> my immunity, so yeah, <laughs> it's great. <laughs> so yeah, now I am waiting for more tests and I will need a uh, hemo, so yeah, lucky me. <laughs> and I look like <sighs> I'm totally mess because my moods I switching between I can do it, I can beat it, so let's fight. And other day I have mood like screw it and fuck it and I don't want to live anymore and why me, why this happening to me, so yeah. I'm a totally mess right now. I <laughs> my hair, my pink hair are growing up, so I have big brown roots. My <laughs> natural browns are showing up because I'm not plugging them out and yeah and I wear same <laughs> same a design of manicure over two months <laughs> so I'm lazy uh, or not lazy, I am scared to change <laughs> this little thing. I don't know why, but sometimes my brain is fixating at something and <laughs> like this, and it makes me more comfy and. I don't know. I'm uh, scared. I'm uh, really scared. I'm. I don't. I don't. I don't want to die. So yeah. I don't know what stage of Hodgkin lymphoma I have. I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting for the results. I need to go to pet to pet scan. So they check all my uh, immune system, my limbs, and my lymphatic system, and they will searching they will looking for all the 
uh, cancer in my lymph so I don't know yet how bad how bad it is but <laughs> it is really bad for my mental health it returns me almost uh, 15 16 years back when I struggle because I find out I cannot have uh, babies I cannot have kids so yeah it's a month after my surgery and I and I don't know what to do Almost all month I was locked at my home doing nothing because because of my health and my mind it was still working what's wrong with me what's happening and why right now and what's the reason and after I got the results and it show up that I have Hodgkin lymphoma I was totally down and And this time, at this time, I wanted to give up, give up everything, but there is a, no other option than fight, <laughs> so I will fight. And I hope I can beat it but because my brain is me messing up I got uh, I got pills again and Uh, the same situation as when I was 16, 17 <sighs> my brain just <laughs> didn't want to work so yeah that's the tea <laughs> that's the of my life right now and I am trying to work out if I can if I feel it I go out and run or ride a bicycle because I want to build endorphins in my uh, body by myself so workouts are really great for it but at the same time I need I need the medication and yeah it helps but I am really sleepy because of the pills 
and I don't like it. Sleep all days and all nights. Yeah, and my scar from the my scar <laughs> is really sensitive. It's healing well, but it's still sensitive to the sun, to the wind. <laughs> especially to my sweat it's ironic because I need to wear these scarves but it makes me <laughs> sweat because it's a summer and so if I go out I immediately I'm immediately sweating as hell so I look look like this or I am locked at home and if I am locked I am locked with my mind with my thoughts and it's bad so I wasn't in the mood last few weeks to uh, to film any any video for the YouTube for you. So I don't know if I want if I want to continue or not. That's it, that's the update. That's the update. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on the notification bell and leave me comment <laughs> if you want. And yeah. I see you next time, hopefully it will be soon, but right now, I don't know what to do, so bye bye.